Protests flared up in Nigeria Thursday over the government's failure to secure the release of 220 teenage girls still held by Islamist militants Boko Haram, nearly three weeks after they were seized from their schoolrooms in the remote northern region of the country. Demonstrations took place in Lagos, the northern city of Kaduna, and the capital of Abuja, where crowds carried signs and sang. Of the 273 schoolgirls seized by Islamist fighters, 53 managed to get away. The fates of the girls still in captivity remains uncertain. Those who escaped say that they were forced into doing menial labor. Some said that some of their schoolmates were sold as sex slaves. WSJ's Drew Hinshaw says reports of the missing girls have captivated and horrified the normally jaded Nigerian public. This is the Forum Bureau, WSJ's global news update.